drops in the breakaway late. Bosch has got his first bucket of the night. The 76ers trail by nine. Pick by Okafor. Lee outside. Okafor inside. Right side's there. Okafor gets the bucket. Okafor's got 10 points. And really, the defense didn't do a lot to fight around that screen on that possession. Ellis kicks to Wade. Bosch heads the pick for Wade. Back to Ellis. What's up a three? No good on that last second attempt there. And we finished one half of basketball. Kevin, I'm here with Coach Eric Spolstra. And Eric, you guys have seemed in complete command out here tonight. What's been the key so far? Well, I, I think uh, we've been able to... Okay, guys, listen up. We're on the brink of a big win here. If we can build on the positives and eliminate the negatives, this is critical. First of all, a big nod to how well we've taken care of the basketball. We're not taking any of Welcome back to our coverage of the NBA Eastern Conference Final as we get things started once again. You look at Freak in this game, he has been everywhere. Yeah, he's been a revelation tonight. Almost scoring at will in that first half. You know, it's really hard to fathom he'll be able to keep it up for the next two quarters, but, you know, you never know. It could be a special night for him. Well, we've got a moment. Let's set the floor. Brought to you by Gatorade all fueled up for the second half. And for Miami, look at who they've got out there. The big man of Bosch and Whiteside. Delayed out there with Ellis. And it's Winslow in at the three. The 76ers have converted one of two free throws so far today. He doesn't get the second one. Miami leading by nine. Ellis outside. Bosch dishes to Ellis. Back to Bosch. Five to shoot. Ellis in the post. Excellent D there from Okafer. The 76ers trail by nine. Pass to Grant. Three-pointer. Can't get it to go. Ellis with some nice D. Little over a minute gone here in the second half. Philadelphia shooting 52% from the floor. Nice work so far from them. Here's Bosniak, and it's sent back by Bosch. Ellis outside from deep. Some solid defense from Grant. And he made sure not to just draw the foul. That was good defense out on the perimeter. Very good. He's a thinking man's defender. He knows how to bother even the best shooters without being overly aggressive. Finally, they get one to drop. That's one of their first four here in the third. Kyle Korver, he's checked in for Miami. Rogic comes in for Dwayne Wade. Philadelphia also making some changes. Joel Embiid, he's checked in for Okafor. Nerlens Noel comes in for Lee. And Jakar Sampson subbed in for Jeremy Grant. Ellis, the pass to Whiteside. Rogic kicks to Ellis. Outside Bosch shoots the three. Yes, and it's Ellis picking up the assist. Ellis has got his third assist on the night. And really, it looks like he may just try to take this thing over on his own and really build that lead up. 13 feet away. And it's Whiteside with the rebound. 
Whiteside's got his third rebound on the night. Yeah, the offense scuffling a bit to start this second half. Only one for the first five. Near the three-point line, it's Ellis. And the shot falls short this time. He's been anything but his usual self this quarter. It's actually been ugly to see. There's a screen by Noel. Launches it. They grab their own miss. Shot is good, and the Heat's lead is cut down to eight on the bucket from Sampson. Just lazy defense on the glass there. Well, nobody boxed out. Nobody put a body on anybody else. Things like that not only drive the coach crazy, that stuff gets under my skin. Ellis dishes to Whiteside. Misses, and he wants that one back. Yeah, great look, but disappointing with the miss. Boy, what happened on that one, Greg? I mean, that's almost an automatic shot for him. And Ellis throws it down. And unfortunately, we've seen a few too many of those. A lack of concentration and alertness, a turnover, and an easy bucket the other way in transition. And really, a few more of those in this game could be over. They can't guard us on the perimeter. But spread the floor and isolate up top. Spacing, fellas. Spacing. Let's find out what Doris Burke has for us. Hey, Kevin, during that last break. Well, Heat leading by six. Taking a look at the... Seventy Sixers. Carl Landry is out there with David Lee. Then there's Okafor. Then it's Joel Embiid, and it's Noel in at the three set. And he's on his way to putting up a big three-point total. Seventy Sixers have gone three of six from the field so far in the fourth quarter. Over to the left wing. Okafor, the pass to Landry. The fifteen-footer, good. I like the recognition of the mismatch there, immediately making the defense pay. Fourth quarter of play, and we're about two and a half minutes. Through it right now. Whiteside kicks to Ellis. Feeds it to Winslow. Six to shoot. Pass to Bosch. And Embiid pulls it down. Well, you know, that's one thing they've been doing extremely well. Corralling those carrots. Yeah, that's about the only thing. There's not a whole lot else going right for them thus far. Landry dishes to Okafor. No good. Well, he'd go the other way with it. And a wide open look here for Ellis. And again, Miami with the triple. He is on fire from behind the arc. Yeah, it seems like all of his points are coming from deep, Greg. Andre passes to Okafor. Pulled the shot a little left, but the bounce goes his way. And the deeper we get into this game, it seems like the more the offenses are in rhythm. Without question, I mean, both of these teams are firing a full broadband bandwidth. The full throttle in here. Landry gets to Okafer. Unloads from 13. Miami grabs the miss. Whiteside's got six rebounds now in the game. Stolen by Landry. Right side against Noel. Inside, Okafor. What a stellar outing in this one for Okafor. He has 14 points, and he's also been picking up some nice assists here and there, too. And Clark, that needs to continue. When he has an opportunity to get an open teammate the ball, he has got to make that a priority. And the second free throw, no good. A tough break there. 
Boy, they came out of the locker room at halftime with a much more physical disposition than they had in the first half. And that helps, Clark. They've got extra trips to the foul line, and they need that to continue if they're going to get back in this game. Picked by Lee. Poked away. And now Ellis running the floor all by himself. Good on the shot. Ellis has got eight points in the quarter. And an important part of every team's game, a look at the hustle stats for Miami. Defensively, they played with a lot of energy, and the steals we've seen are a result of that aggressiveness. Something that's also benefited them tonight are the turnovers they forced and the points that have come along with those forced turnovers. I mean, even from over here, you can see that one pretty clearly. No question about it, Greg. I mean, a ton of contact and a good call by the officials. Both free throws good for Mocha Four. Kicks it to Lee. And it's Ellis penetrating, and he jams it with authority. Man, if ever there were a way to kick off the NBA Conference Finals, this is it. Going to be a table-setting victory here in Game 1 for Miami. Clark, look at their number of assists. Well, they minimized the one-on-one -on -one situations, Kevin. They got the ball moving, and it found the open guy. Great ball move. You're right. And beyond the actual result of this game, fans are going to look back and, and see this was just a monstrous performance for Ellis. It was the kind of game for him that all scorers dream of, where the basket seemed as wild as a barrel. And it's slammed in by Whiteside. Terrific run to seal the deal. Yeah, and now let's just keep an eye on how much longer they keep the foot on the accelerator. To the wing right side, takes the three. It's hauled in by the Heat. Oh, and here we go. Ellis has got it. The fast break chance. And the basket by Wayne. And that's just a little more for these fans to cheer about as they get ready to celebrate a W. Well, let the party start. The celebration begins, and they're going to let their guys hear it. No good from Grant. And Miami can just let the clock run down here. And Ellis the bucket on the assist by Wade. 34 points for free. Bosnia. Wade is covering. Lee is screen on Wade. From the arc. Can't get it to fall. And so Miami takes this one by a big margin. A pretty good feeling right now for them to be out in front like this in the series. You know, Kevin, momentum is so, so critical. And you know they'll want to ride this wave into game two. And a chance now to send you over to Doris Burke standing by on the sideline. Doris? The 2K Sports Post Game Show. Ernie Johnson here again with Shaquille O'Neal and Kenny Smith. Without further ado, let's present to you our Jordan player of the game, Freak. He just put it completely out of reach in the fourth quarter. It was as if he was saying, okay, enough fooling around. I'm taking over now. Ernie, that is the definition of domination. He took them to school tonight in every possible way. I know there's 10 players on the court, but I only noticed one. Starting out the series, this is a huge win to go up 1-0. He gave them the energy and effort they needed. Huge performance, and what a time to do it. If he can keep up this effort, Ernie, boy, oh boy, oh boy. And thanks for watching tonight's coverage of the NBA Conference Finals, and there's more coming your way. For Shaq, for Kenny, Ernie Jones.